More people are eligible to get the COVID shot. People under the age of 65 with pre existing conditions can get it at pharmacies and doctor's offices. School employees and law enforcement officers who are 50 and older can also get the shot. But for people with pre existing conditions, it's kind of the honor system. Fox 35's Danielle Lama joins us live tonight. She's covering that angle of the story, Danielle. Yeah, Charles, a lot of questions tonight about a document or set of criteria people who are medically vulnerable may need to get the vaccine. It's mentioned in the governor's executive order, but no one appears to have seen it yet. Right now, I'm dealing with cerebral palsy, um, me, epilepsy, and, and um, asthma. 23-year-old Nicholas Solt says trying to get the COVID-19 vaccine has been frustrating. The Brevard County man has a doctor's note, but hasn't been able to land an appointment. Having the vaccine is just an extra layer of protection for me. Governor DeSantis just made the vaccine more accessible for people who are under 65 and considered medically vulnerable to COVID. In a new executive order, he's allowing doctor's offices and pharmacies to vaccinate those folks, but one line is causing some confusion. It says such physician determinations shall include a statement that the patient meets the defined eligibility criteria established by a form prescribed by the Florida Department of Health. Problem is that form doesn't appear to be available yet. I hope that soon. Uh, and I don't know what the content is going to be. Orange County Health Officer Dr. Raul Pino says he found out about the expanded eligibility today. Officials trying to keep up with the changes before they go into effect March 3rd. We have at least two days, almost three days, uh, to be able to uh, organize. Pharmacies also scrambling. Publix opened their appointments to the high-risk group this morning, while Walmart and CVS were still working on it. Those who could qualify, watching what happens next closely. That's the biggest thing I'm praying for right now. Orange County health officials say they do not plan on vaccinating those who are high risk at the Orange County Convention Center for now. They are, however, updating the website so that teachers, law enforcement and firefighters over 50 can sign up. Reporting live in Orange County, Daniel Lama, Fox 35 News.